Let's move now to Niger State, where Christians have gathered at the Cathedral Church of St. Michael to lay to rest the remains of the slain Catholic priest, Reverend Father Isaac Achi, who was burnt to death by bandits earlier in the week at his residence in Paikul, Niger State. Well, I have joining me now TVC News correspondent Chenemi Bamiyi, who is at the funeral uh, right there. Chenemi, it's good to have you join us right now. Can you bring us up to speed with uh, the developments there? Uh, good afternoon. Right now, um, Christians are gathered to, to let to raise the remains of Father Isaac Achi. Uh, he was killed on Sunday morning at his residence. Right now, there's no any information as regards um, the identity of his killers. Uh, just some days ago, the state government led a high-power delegation to uh, condole the, the, the Minadouses Cathedral of the Catholic Church. And then they promised to build a new church for them in that locality, although it was the parish house that was burnt, um, and that's where Father Isaac Archie was. You know, but that's not really the concern right now. The concern is what is the state government doing to beef up security in that area? Uh, this, same, um, this same slain Catholic priest in 2011, um, in his parish at St. Teresa Catholic Church, Madala, was the first place where there was bomb blast attack um, on Christmas Day. And then um, he has been shot after that time. Just a, a couple of days ago, his nephew was killed by bandits. And um, the priest, his assistant, is still undergoing um, medical treatment because he was shot in that same incident where he died. Has there been any further arrests of uh, those who... Uh, would have been suspected to have perpetrated this, this act? Well, no arrest has been made yet. Uh, matter of fact, on Tuesday, uh, angry youths in the community took to the street and they burned down the, poli the police divisional um, office in the, in the community because they, were, they felt um, the police did not act on time because the, the Reverend Father actually sent distress call to the police and other members of the family, but there was no help till the people, till his, um, his killers had finished what, what they came to do. So the people are angry. They've gone down the police station over there and no arrest has been made yet. All right, Chenemi, we'll keep a tab on what's going on there. Thank you for letting us know what's up in Niger State.